Good morning, guys. It is a little bit of a busy day today. I don't know. I mean, obviously, I'm a stay-at-home mom. I set my own schedule. But I do have a lot of things that I should get done today. Got Lucy over here eating breakfast. She actually woke up earlier than usual. She got up at 9 o'clock, which, if you know her, is like an hour and a half earlier than usual. So that was okay with me. We got our day started. I got a shower, so I'm already like... Today's a good day. If I can get a shower in the morning and Lucy was awake while I did it, things are going well. Um, I also need to get to, put you guys right here because I got, oh, the lighting's terrible. Let's move over here. Um, I also need to get to Costco today because I'm out of absolutely everything. Matthew's been liking it lately if I wait for him to go with us because A, he doesn't like me lifting all the stuff, which is kind of silly it's fine if it's too heavy I don't know if you guys know this if it's too heavy you can totally ask somebody at Costco to to lift it for you into your cart and to go out to your car and put it in your car but um I don't really have a problem Matthew's just a goofball I'm eating instant oatmeal this morning I usually buy like you know regular oatmeal and add my own apples and cinnamon and stuff but Matthew bought these when he went to a um like one of our quick grocery runs on his way home from work one time when I was like oh I need I don't remember what I needed that time, something. But he bought some instant oatmeal, and I've been so lazy and it's been so good, so that's what I've been doing. Um, anyway, Matthew's been wanting me to wait for him to go to Costco lately, but I'm out of like milk, um, bread, lunch meat, I'm out of like everything, and that's before I even meal planning. So I'm going to make this instant oatmeal, try to do my meal planning and grocery list while I eat, and then maybe Lucy and I are headed to Costco. Um, actually, we might wait until a little later in the day. Let me just run through my plans with you and figure out why they're not gonna work because um, if I go later in the day, I can just pick up Costco pizzas for dinner. And y'all know me, I hate cooking, especially on a day that I've been to Costco because it's a ton of work. Um, so I might do that. And I'm also trying, so we buy the vast majority of things at Costco, you guys know that. Anything that Costco sells, basically that's where I buy it. This is Happy Meal toy from the other day. But I'm trying to be better about couponing the things that I don't buy at Costco. So, that's another thing I'm working on this morning. And what else, what else, what else? Um, my mom's in town, she's actually upstairs showering um, to help my grandma. Like you guys know, she comes every other week. And maybe, maybe I don't need Costco pizza because I'm going to talk with her and see if maybe um, she can hang out with Lucy this evening and Matthew and I can go to dinner because he is actually not working late for the first time in, I can't even remember how long. He gets off at a normal time today, 4 o'clock. And um, so it'd be fun to go out to dinner with him. However, um, October tends to be a little bit of an emotional month for my grandma. It, um, the beginning of October is her wedding anniversary and the end of October is when we lost my grandpa. So it tends to be a little bit of a hard month and um, you know, that's okay. I can't imagine what those emotions feel like. But um, that often means my mom's spending a little bit more time with her while she's here. You know, she doesn't really want to be alone in the evenings and stuff. So that, us going out to dinner may or may not work out and that's fine. But we'll figure it out. Lucy, what are you doing? She has been loving to eat at this big girl table. Look at her. She just decided she's grown up. You know, she sleeps in a big girl bed now. No problems. Never had a problem. And I'll have to show you guys her cute bedding now. I will show you tonight. And she's decided, you know, we used to have the booster seat here. It's gone now because even when she sits up at the bar, she doesn't want the booster seat. She's decided she's a grown up. Haven't you, Lucy? Are you a grown up? Yeah. Anyway, let's get the day started so that I can get my stuff done. Later. Okay, it's been forever. I've got my meal plan sort of done. Um, I like to plan for two weeks at a time. I do have to go back in between for um, produce, but I like to have my plan done for two weeks. I'm missing two days, but honestly, it'll probably be leftovers or um, our friend Kenneth who lives with us likes to get food on Sundays sometimes. So missing two days is not really that big of a deal. It'll fill in. Um, my Costco list is not super long this time. So that's my Costco list if you care. 
I mean, there are things like salad stuff and fruit that like, that's multiple items, but I just write, you know, one little line. Um, but that's a pretty, pretty short Costco list for us. Oh, Betty is getting into trouble in the backyard. This is my like, everywhere that's not Costco list. And I don't know if you can see, but I've got written next to them like, um, pork chops are $1.99 a pound at Save Mart, and that's a pretty good price, and we haven't had pork chops in a while. And, like, um, what else, what else? Uh, asparagus is only $1.98 a pound at Sprouts, and so I have, like, that written next to the item, because, like I said, I'm trying to shop these ads now. But I'm also feeling like I'm just gonna drive over town, all over town and waste gas. <sighs> I don't know. We're gonna give it a shot this week, because I, I do feel like we spend a lot of money on food, which is okay. Like, I don't know, it's not like it's bankrupting us. But at the same time, I don't know, we spend about 600 bucks a month on food. Probably a little more than that. And um, it's a lot of money. So if I could cut it down a little bit, that would be good. But we'll see how this goes. So Save Mart is actually right next to Costco. So I'm gonna take a cooler to put the cold things from Costco in and it's actually a pretty chilly day so i'm not even really that concerned because the car is going to stay cold but i will take a cooler to put the cold things in so that i can run into save mart and get the, i think like four things i need at save mart yeah i don't know i'm not liking this <laughs> i hate, hate meal planning to begin with it's my least favorite chore Ever. Like I, uh, I'm sure I've said this before, but like I'd rather scrub the toilets or get down on my hands and knees and scrub the floor than meal plan. I just hate it. Hate it, hate it, hate it. I don't particularly love cooking, but it's the planning and making the grocery list part that I really hate. But Lucy is ready to go bye-bye. And then you'll notice on my, my meal list here at the top, I have Costco pizza, because I was thinking tonight I'm gonna bring home a pizza from Costco for dinner but it's 12:41, and i'm ready to go ahead and go shopping and so that's too early to bring home warm pizzas with me for dinner so probably it's just going to end up ordering pizza from somewhere which a will be more expensive and b um i don't know i kind of like costco pizza but at the same time lucy's ready to get out of the house this grocery shopping stuff is stressing me out we're just gonna get it done right lucy do you want to go to costco hey do you want to go to costco Lily, hold this. Okay, thank you. She, thanks. She loves to share her Z bars with me. Those Cliff bars for kids. I don't usually eat this little wadded up piece that she gives me, but she likes to share. Anyway, gonna let Betty in. Gonna get shoes on. Gonna change Lucy's diaper. Gonna get to Costco. All right, we're most of the way through Costco. The cart's getting so heavy. Are you all done with Costco? We could not find daddy's barbecue chips. I had to go back and get chicken twice because I noticed the bag was split open halfway through. And I'm having a very hard time leaving here without buying a three pack of Cap'n Crunch for like six bucks, but we're gonna do it. My cart's loaded, we're ready to go. Shopping trip is finally done. My mom actually beat me home, so I'm having her put the dogs outside real quick. This girl fell asleep, but not only did she fall asleep, she stole my Sour Patch Kids. I picked those up at um, the regular grocery store Save Mart when I, I don't know, I just thought, oh, I want these. These sound good. I'll have them for later. And then the sweet, sweet teenage cashier, or not cashier, but the bagger, was trying to be helpful while Lucy was fussing. I was like, here, you want to hold a candy? So Lucy ended up with my Sour Patch Kids, but that's okay. I can share. <sighs> now to unload everything. This is such... A huge chore. Matthew should be home any minute so he can help me. Hey guys, welcome to date night. Are you excited to have a date night? It's been a while, we caught him chewing. We are at our favorite little, and it's not that little I guess, but local Mexican place. My grandma actually gave us a gift card for Lucy's birthday. She's done that both birthdays now as like a congratulations for making it through a year of parenting, which is so sweet because honestly, Lucy gets so much stuff, so she's not really missing out on like a toy. Mm -hmm. It's heretic art here. A few moments later. And super nice, super thoughtful. And this is basically like a free date night for us. So that's hey. nice. And my mom's here, so she's with Lucy. And we're also gonna finish up my last grocery store. Um, well, actually it's not quite my last one. Last major, like 
I told you guys I'm shopping the ads this week, so I have I have one more grocery store I want to stop at today, and Max is gonna go with me, right? Mm, yeah. <laughs> I just keep catching and chewing. Mm -hmm. How was your day at work? Long. You, I'm sorry. It's okay. Yeah. I'm sure he thinks we're so weird talking to a camera. <laughs> oh well. But welcome to date night. I got a taco truck burrito. And salsa on your sweater already. Oh, you can't see it on the camera. Dang it. You get it uh, oh, well. usually me. It is usually not me. I got a taco truck burrito. What'd you get? And Chaw Supreme. Or took quesadilla. One of the two. <laughs> you got a quesadilla. And then also some guacamole, which is one of my favorite things. So I'm excited to be on a date night. What date night would be complete without a stop to Target for a potty seat? Randomly, the last few days, Lucy has been telling me she needs to go potty and wants to sit on the potty. And more often than not, she's already gone, but I figure if she wants to sit on the potty, we're gonna keep doing that. So I have a seat upstairs in my bathroom, but I don't have one downstairs. So I've just been like holding her over the toilet. So we wanted to pick up a potty seat. So she has one for downstairs too. Now that she's showing some interest, um, I still don't think that she's quite ready. Um, obviously I will encourage any amount of interest that she has but my expectations are not high because like I said most of the time she's already gone when she's telling me that she has to go potty so eventually I'm sure it'll click but I'm not pushing at this point and Matthew is looking for a video game and I don't remember what else we need here hopefully we get out of here for pretty inexpensive because we really didn't I mean all we needed was this $15 potty seat so hopefully we don't spend too much and just like that, we're home to this girl. You ready to go sleeping? For your ready time for your story? Okay, should we say goodnight to our friends? Hi friends. Hi friends, good job. Hi friends, Sam, ready to go goodnight. Did you have a good day with grandma? Did you have fun with grandma this evening? Bye friends. Bye friends. Like she's really ready for bed, so make sure you're following us on Snapchat and Instagram, and we will see you guys next time. Bye!